Fight fans, we're finally here. The undisputed heavyweight fight. The first undisputed heavyweight fight in over 20 years. The last time we had this kind of bout was when Lennox Lewis defeated Banda, the real deal Holyfield. And now, after many postponements, many setbacks, failed deals, disappointing cancellations, we are finally here. The ultimate showdown to find out who the best fighter in the heavyweight division is. Tyson, the Gypsy King Fury, or Alexander Usyk. We've made a number of videos on this matchup, broken down the different tactics of the fighters, explained why we think even though they are extremely good fighters in their own right, we don't believe that this fight is going to be that close and in this video we're gonna give our final prediction. But before we go ahead, please hit the like and subscribe button to help the channel. A couple of pointers here. Tyson Fury, as we all know, is looking leaner than ever. He's going to be a lot lighter on his feet than he was in his last fight. He's going to be a lot lighter on his feet than he certainly was during the Deontay Wilder trilogy. But regardless of how lean he's looking, it's obvious that he will not be as quick as Alexander Usyk. Alexander Usyk's pace at the heavyweight division is just incomparable. The second point that we're going to talk about is the fact that even though Tyson Fury is looking a lot leaner and he has lost weight, let's not forget something. Losing weight doesn't always translate to better stamina. Just because he looks a lot leaner doesn't mean that this will automatically translate into superb stamina. And it doesn't necessarily mean that Tyson Fury is going to keep up with Alexander Usyk's pace for 12 rounds. Usyk, on the other hand, looks like he's certainly grown into the heavyweight division. He looks like a legit heavyweight right now. Usyk also looks a lot more confident than Tyson Fury, despite all of the man games that have been thrown. In our previous video, we talk about two main issues that would affect the outcome of the fight greatly. Whether or not Usyk will be able to manage Tyson Fury's size, i.e. will Usyk Nelson Interestingly, he was the referee for the Manny Pacquiao Jeff Horn fight, and he controversially allowed loads of headbutts and dirty tactics from Jeff Horn. If he allowed this, does this mean that he's going to be just as tolerant in this fight? And if so, will this favor Tyson Fury? But all that aside, let's go for my final prediction. We have to weigh things up. Tyson Fury looking a lot leaner going to be a lot quicker on his feet. He's got the size. It appears that he might be able to get away with some dirty tactics given the referee that we have right now. But ultimately, based on Usyk's supreme record, Usyk just simply knows how to win. We've almost never seen him in a close fight. The closest that he's come to being in danger was in the ninth round against Anthony Joshua. Over. But ultimately, throughout his entire pre he borderline lost against, counted out against Deontay Wilder in the first fight when he got knocked down on the canvas. He arguably lost his fight against Francis Ngannou. Regardless of the fact that Tyson Fury has the superior size, on paper, he should be able to defeat Alexander Usyk. I just don't see something happening that we've never seen happen suddenly have a very comfortable decision victory for Alexander Usyk and Alexander Usyk is going to be crowned the first undisputed heavyweight champion in over 20 years that's my final prediction and we'll talk to you after the fight